Hey guys, Billy Jenkins here with Silver Creek Doodles. So we have went ahead and met Deborah's guardians and picked her up. She is due in just a few days and oh my goodness, her belly is massive. So Deborah is our F1 mini, but thick, our mini Bernie Doodle. So I'm so excited. So an F1 is first generation. So we did end up breeding her to our F1B Aussie Doodle, Hank, that's only about 14 pounds. So the biggest thing is we wanted a small size and this breed together is actually one of the most common breeds with the Bernie Doodle mixes. So I'm so excited for this litter. I'm so excited for Deborah. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you, we went ahead and met her guardian. My goodness he was so sad i love it because like they're best friends she is everywhere with him all the time like i'm just it's made me really sad because even after we did the ultrasound and we found out she was pregnant he's like when's her when does she got to come to you and how long does she have to stay and i have to prepare myself and i get it because oh my goodness if i had to let dave go somewhere i would be heartbroken like i don't know obviously it's what they signed up for they know what they were doing we are here if they want to come and visit, they can. Obviously, we kind of recommend not to, in this little short week of time while they're here before they have their babies, they just need to be here, get comfy, you know, learn their area. And then once they have their babies, we need them to be growing at least for the first week and gaining weight before family comes and visit. But I know they will be here as soon as they can. So I'm so excited about this whole process. You know, in my videos, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tag the videos below but you know, when we went to breed Deborah, I hadn't seen her in a while. She was thick, like she was chunky. I'm like, she's gonna have to lose some weight. So it's just funny because I said, just keep feeding what you're doing. Don't feed any more through this whole thing. We do have to let her thin down some. Sometimes dogs that are overweight either have small litters or don't get pregnant. So it's we kind of were throwing that up in the air too. But y'all will see, I went ahead and groomed her when she was here when we bred her, you know, shaved her down. I'm like, well, she doesn't look as fat, but she's still pretty chunky. But then right now when she's walking away, and I'm going to try to get a video of it, like she's walking away and you can see her hips and then her belly does this and goes, I'm like, oh my goodness, how many puppies? And nobody is on her wait list. Whew. So I'm, I'm not worried, but I do know that like once they're born and we see what they are, we're going to have, you know, he's a chocolate phantom Merle, but she doesn't carry chocolate. So 75, so each puppy has a 75% of being black based. All the black based are going to be phantom. So it's going to be kind of like mom, you know, black phantom, 50% chance of being Merle like dad colored up. The Merles can have blue eyes, so that's kind of exciting. And then there is a 25% chance that they can either be cream, apricot, or red. You know, that um, color is just, you know, cream and red are the same color. It's just the intensity that they're going to have. So I am so excited. So today is Thursday. Deborah is due Monday. So she's been doing fantastic while she's here. She's eating, obviously. She's eating perfectly fine. She is just, she's hanging out, just hanging out. She is resting. She did kind of have a little bit of spit up this morning, morning sickness kind of thing, but she's doing fine. I am so excited, but I wanted to show picking her up and all that stuff. So let me get done talking. We're going to show picking her up and then we did get her groomed and then we're just going to show her off a little and then we will be prepared hopefully Sunday, Monday, Tuesday to share some videos of some new puppies. Deborah, Hey, pretty girl. Look at that belly. Hey, darling. <laughs> oh my goodness. There's that pretty girl. Look at your tummy, my goodness gracious. You're huge, baby girl. Uh, 38 seat cup now. <laughs> I'd say I can feel them. I can feel them down there, yeah. <laughs> Get between daddy's legs. <laughs> She's feeling daddy's gonna be really sad, huh? Very sad. I know. But we'll get over it. No, yeah, it'll get it'll it'll, it'll go by quicker than you expect. I promise. I, so. I promise. Hey, pretty girl. <laughs> hey, darling. You're a sweet girl.
So here is just a preview of her puppy area. It is spacey. We've got the heat lamp. She's got water full time and she's resting. There's my pretty girl. Darling, look at that belly. Let's get this hair off and see really how big she is. There she is. can't tell by video, but she's got a pretty big belly. What do you think, Miss Deborah? What do you think, baby girl? You're sweet. You're a good girl. <laughs> Deborah! Deborah, look here. Hey. hey, look here. It's so funny. She always, she just, she's so serious and she looks away and she lays away. <laughs> we'll get some other videos and stuff of her when she's outside, but she's not showing herself off. You pretty girl. Hey, Deborah. <laughs> How you doing, darling? She's so sweet. Look at this belly. Oh my goodness, her oh, so pretty. Deborah, do you know how to sit? Hey, can you sit? Okay, maybe not. I ain't gonna make a pregnant girl have to sit. <laughs> I ain't gonna make a pregnant girl have to sit. You are a good girl. You are a good girl. Let's see. Oh. There's our belly, holy moly. Holy moly. Behind you, stay, stay. Like, can you see that belly? Like, it dips in. Hey guys, <laughs> it dips in, but then it whew, comes out on both sides. Pudgy, pudgy, pudgy. Yes, you are. <gasps> Deborah, you're so sweet. So sweet, pretty girl. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you are interested in this litter, let me know. So in the description is gonna be the puppy application. Go to my website, copy the question, paste it to an email, type in between, get it sent over, and then we'll see if it looks like you're a family that you know, we'll purchase one of our puppies and it seems like a good fit. But again, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're not subscribed yet, don't forget to hit that subscribe link. Give us a thumbs up if you like these types of videos and we'll see you next time.